totally apply the mask and when I apply this mask on my face I like to just you know give it a little form of a exfoliating and kind of push it up a little just massage going to be lifting, tightening and firming the skin. I am going to show you an homemade facial mask that you can apply to your face. It's going to help to smooth the wrinkles and fine lines. It's going to lift, tighten and firm the skin. Guys, I'm going to share a live demo with you just to show you how effective this facial mask is. I'm using all natural ingredients, ingredients that you probably already have in your kitchen. Guys, this is so amazing. So if you're looking for an anti-aging facial mask, that is going to get the job done. Don't go away. Stay tuned for the recipe and also for the live demonstration. Let's go. Now our this. first ingredient so is coffee and here I have some ground coffee. You can choose to use either ground coffee, coffee beans or your already brewed coffee for this recipe. Now coffee contains antioxidants that will help to smooth the wrinkles and fine lines on the skin. It also will help to boost the collagen production in the skin. I like using coffee on the skin because coffee enzyme will also help to get rid of scars from the skin. It also guys will have your skin just looking radiant with a natural glow so what I'm gonna do with the coffee I'm gonna be blending it even further to a powder but let's put the coffee aside and introduce my next ingredient my next ingredient is rice another amazing natural ingredient for the skin you can use rice in your hair but you can also use it on your face when applied topically to the skin rice is gonna have to smooth wrinkles and fine lines It's also gonna hydrate the skin rice enzyme is great for mature skin so definitely a must in your homemade facial remedies so I'm gonna use one tablespoon of the rice I'm gonna place this in the blender and next I'm gonna reach for the coffee and I'm gonna use the same amount one tablespoon of the coffee pour this in the blender and I'm gonna blend it two together to a powder if you're using coffee beans go ahead and use two tablespoons of your coffee bean so now we're just gonna cover and we're gonna blend now after blending take a look let's pour this out our blended coffee and rice you want the mixture to be very powder like like this so what you can do with this guys you can pour this in an airtight container and you can store it in your refrigerator this could be in the refrigerator for up to six months and whenever you're ready to make your facial mask you just take it out and use it so guys so what I'm gonna do right now I'm gonna use about a tablespoon and a little extra pouring this in the blender so we have a tablespoon of coffee and rice and you're gonna need hot water for this recipe so make sure you have some hot water boiling before you start to put this together I'm gonna use some aloe vera gel in this facial mask guys which is another amazing ingredient for the skin if you have fresh aloe vera gel it's perfect for this recipe I'm using one tablespoon of the aloe vera gel I'm also going to use a little bit of a rose water in this recipe. 
I'm using about a teaspoon of rose water. Pour that in. And we're using just one oil in this. Today I'm using sweet almond oil. However, use whatever oil you have. You don't need a lot. Just about a half a teaspoon of sweet almond oil. This amount I'm making is for one use. And then we're reaching for our hot water. And I'm going to pour about a tablespoon of hot water in the mixture. And you want to cover and blend right away. Give it a little shake. If you do not have a blender, you can use a spoon to stir this our form. Once this is done, take a look. Here we have our coffee rice facial mask. And now we're going to pour this out in our storage container. Please note that this is still very hot, guys. So once you pour this out, here we have it, our, our anti-aging facial mask. What you're going to do, you're going to put this aside to cool, which is going to take about an half an hour or so. Make sure it's completely cooled and then it's ready to use on your face. Store this in your refrigerator for about seven days. This amount is good for about one to two use and this can be used two to three times per week for best results. So I'm going to set mine aside to cool and then I'm going to come back and show you how to use this on your face for best results. So here we have the facial mask and what I'm going to do today, I'm going to apply it to just one side of my face so I'm gonna apply it to this side of my face and I'm just gonna dig in I just want you to see the before and after difference of applying this to my face so oh this smells really really good guys like really really good so just apply it on your face you cover your entire face with this for demonstration I'm just doing a half of my face when I'm done I'm gonna go back and apply this to my entire face because I really love this mask okay so totally apply the mask and when I apply this mask on my face I like to just you know give it a little form of a exfoliating and kind of push it up a little just massage my cheekbones with the mask and just massage it like I'm showing here and once this is done and we're gonna go back in and then I'm just gonna cover the hair a second time now this is a anti-aging wrinkle fighting facial mask guys it's perfect guys for those of you who are looking for instant result especially if you have to go somewhere and you want your face to just look radiant and glowing you just use this mask so now that my face is covered with the mask what I'm gonna do I'm gonna sit with it for about 30 minutes on my skin after 30 minutes you're gonna rinse this off preferably with some cold water so I'm gonna sit with mine for 30 minutes rinse off and then I'm gonna come back and show you my now design. guys I've been wearing this for about 20 minutes so far on my skin and my skin is feeling really really good right now it's just feeling hydrated like you know just a really nice a feeling cooling feeling to it so I'm gonna sit another 10 minutes and then I'm gonna rinse off and I will be back with the result now after removing the facial mask I like to apply a little moisturizer on my skin so I just apply some moisturizer and take a look guys this is it up close guys Amazing. This is the side I applied the facial mask and this is the side that I didn't. This is clearly more plumper, more firmer and this one need a little bit more. So out. there you have it guys, what an amazing facial mask. Now don't just watch this video guys. If you have the ingredient, go ahead and give it a go. Use it on your skin for at least two to three weeks guys. Take a before and after picture and send them to me. And also guys, share this with your friends, share this with your family. And if this was the first time watching, I'm sure you don't want to go away without subscribing. So look below, you're going to see the word subscribe just click on it and you will be subscribed also I have other social media platform such as my Instagram guys over on Instagram we create very short to the point videos so go over there follow me on Instagram I'm also on Facebook Twitter and I'm also on TikTok. so the links to those are below in the description box below thank you all for watching and I'll see you all in my next video bye bye